Thank you so much for clicking on the video. If you're new to my channel, my name is Amy. I do so much of the Isle of Shame. I thought it'd be nice to start off with the food first this time. The stuffing mix is 79 cents each. Plus it gives you guys a good idea of prices right now as inflation goes up. The macaroni and cheese in the box is 43 cents. The shells and cheese original is $1.45. So it's kind of like similar to Velveeta. And if you like any of the products, please let us know in the comments. Or if you don't like them, that way it helps us decide how we spend our money. We've got the instant mashed potatoes for 59 cents. Scalloped or au gratin potatoes for the box is 85 cents. Hope you guys grabbed a snack because this is probably going to be a long video. So the onion mix was 79 cents and the extra noodles, I didn't get the price in the picture. Ah, that's so frustrating. Okay. Next, we had the bone broth for $3.39, organic bone broth. And then they had the organic beef broth for $1.79. And the next picture here, we're going to see the regular broth. And these were $1.29. We had three different ones to choose from. Might have only gotten two of the pictures, but we had three. The Campbell's Cream of Mushroom is $1.18. A lot of us are trying to stretch our budget you doing casseroles, so those prices are good to know. And then the soups, depending on which one you got, $1.78 or $1.98 for the soups. And the Cream of Chicken, same price as the Cream of Mushroom at $1.18. The flushable wipes, $5.99. They say no wipes are flushable, guys, so be careful. $3.89 for some skincare. We have pictures from pretty much everywhere in this store, except again, the dairy and the produce. Toothpaste, we've got Crest for $2.99, and then we've got the Crest for $4.84. I thought it was nice to mix it all up, you know? They did have a lot of the toilet paper in stock, which we've been up and down with that over the last few months. $3.40 for the secret deodorant down from $3.47. Probably cost more to make that little sign on the bottom than to save the seven cents. I'm just kidding. Uh, then they had the vitamin C power blend, $7.65 effervescent. I thought the diapers were a good price. What do you guys think? $3.99? It's pretty good, I think. Actually, I, I, yeah, I really think so. Three eighty nine. I didn't find these worked really well for me. Like they're the knockoff Swiffers. They're okay, but not great. The duster kits were two twenty nine. I've used those; they're fine. Pretty much like the Swiffers. Here's the baby wipes, four nineteen. These did go up. I have purchased these a couple of times. They were like $3.89, $3.99. They went up a little bit. And then $3.35 for the dry cloths. I've never used the dry cloths, only the wet ones. $2.19. The boulder, there's a hundred sandwich bags. This picture's a little further away. These are $2.29. And then they had the paper. These definitely went up a little bit. Four ninety five. It's so tiny on the screen. Uh, Three thirty nine. You guys will see it better because you'll be seeing it on a larger screen for the like fake red solo cups because I edit on my phone. It's tiny. One ninety five for the plastic wrap or two ninety nine for the aluminum foil. Heavy duty as well, just less of it. And then $159 for the napkins. They haven't had those in a while, so they've got those back, so that's good. Paper towels. Paper towels are so expensive. They're not even worth it. Let's go back to dishcloths and other things. But yeah, they had a lot of paper products, as I'm showing you here. And I'm, I'm glad to see it back stocked up, for sure. Now we get into the bars. So we got the advanced bars at $349. These are $465, if I'm seeing that correctly. 
I like their bars. I haven't tried a lot of these ones, but I like the other ones. These are $3.49. Chocolate chip or vanilla chip. These are $4.65. If you hear noise in the background, guys, it's my fan. The Keto. These are a little more expensive per usual. $6.29. The Energy Bars are $4.99. Looks like you had three to choose from. Keto. They must have just stocked these. Look how nice and full this is. These are $4.99. Protein, $2.49. These protein bars, has anybody tried these? I should like compare the backs and see how much protein, more protein they have than the other ones. $4.29 for these. They all look yummy though. They really do look good for these kinds of bars. And then they had for $1.49 the Oatmeal packs, maple and brown cinnamon sugar is my favorite. Maple and brown sugar is my favorite. These I've had and I love, and they're still a really good price at $1.39. I need to go do some more stocking up. Trail Mix bars, these are going to be $1.69. Guys, we're going to see such high increases in the next couple of months into the fall on food. Please try and stock up as much as you can. I know it's tough, but try. Here's some cereal. My phone keeps charging, but it's circling on the screen, so I just unplugged it. So hopefully I'll get a little bit quicker here now. Lots of their uh, cereals are ex so identical that it's definitely worth getting the generic. Um, but they do have some name brands in the store, as you can see here. They have the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Uh, I did some of these baking items a little bit. $1.62 for the brown sugar. Just so you can kind of get an idea and feel if you haven't been in the store lately. A lot of people shop through my videos and then they have someone else shop for them. Their raisin brand here, as you can see, um, the price is on the screen. The shredded wheat I've had, I like it. It's $1.59. Um, or people use Instacart. Just a lot of people are disabled, handicapped that watch me. So hopefully this is going to be helpful for them too. Then we had some graham pie crust here. I've tried their frozen dough. Um, it wasn't good. It was so dry. And then we have some cherry filling. And the price, you really can't see it, guys. Sorry about that. At $3.39. It was tough for the Stevia. It was tough taking these pictures so quick. I did this in like 10 minutes, guys. I took almost 200 pi pictures in 10 minutes. Sugar and flour. So we're gonna see in the sugar here. Next, I'm gonna show you guys the flour, and they must have just got this in too. I'd say stock. I don't use a lot of the sugar or flour, but I definitely would stock up if you can. Four fifty nine. Some of these prices are pretty reasonable, and some of these prices are a little high, but that's literally everywhere right now. Dollar ninety five for the organic. So that's that's not bad. Two fifty nine for the pesto. And then these are a dollar eighty five. I've never tried these. I don't go in the middle aisles. I go in the aisle of shame a lot, but I don't go in a lot of these the food aisles. They have Parmesan cheese for two thirty five. I have had this. It's very it's milled very fine. And then for $1.99, you can get this organic spaghetti. Spaghetti. Spaghetti and meat sauce is one of my favorite meals. Favorite. And they have some more spaghetti. You can get edamame or black soybean. $2.99. Oh, they have these little cups for $2.69. The little mac and cheese cups four pack the craft ones of those have gotten so expensive they're almost six dollars everywhere else some egg noodles i think it's 219 pasta dollar 99 now i want pasta and i put in some snacks here these are dollar 96 does anybody like this popcorn the dill pickle one Gluten-free stuff, gluten-free deluxe mac and cheese, two forty-nine. They do have 
some items of gluten free in my store. Here's some more. Three nineteen for the pasta. I feel like they used to have more in my store. Um, I feel like they've gotten less and less. Chex Mix two forty nine. I love Chex Mix. It's not good for the acid reflex though. So, got the pretzels for a dollar sixty nine. Looks like it went down a little bit in price. Some more pretzels. These are good. Five twenty nine. They went up though. These are the ones with the peanut butter in the middle. Mm, they're good. You can only eat so many because they're filling. And then dollar seventy eight for the plantain chips. Manufactured in the USA. Are they grown here? Probably not. Goya, 65 cents for the crackers. Are these crackers or cookies, guys? I can't see. Cookies, cookies, okay. Uh, then we have some more snacks. 379. Popcorn. And then some baked chips. These are 249. I don't like all these chips, guys. I know a lot of people do. I, I don't I'm not a fan. Oh, and then we got some specialty chips here for $1.57. I mean, the prices are great for the chips. I just, I don't know. And then the rice. They had a lot of rice. Looks like they just brought this in, too. Yeah, it's a good, good thing to stock up on the rice. Some breakfast. I can't speak, apparently. Breakfast biscuits, $3.49. Never had these. And then they got graham crackers, $1.25. I am craving like graham crackers with the pudding on it. What is that called? Ice box cake. Animal crackers, two ninety nine. I don't know why I think of that cake for the summer. Maybe I don't know. It sounds good though. The chips ahoy. Oof, those are too much. There. I mean, it is the party size, but almost six dollars. The vanilla wafers. Oh, maybe you make it with these. You probably make it with both, right? A dollar ninety nine, one or the other. Yeah, I think you could. Uh, the grams, the grams, three nineteen, and then here's their generic of the cookie. Their their take on them. See, look at the price difference. A dollar forty nine. Not the big size, but still, you can buy two of these and still be less. Um, let's see, two forty nine. These are the hundred calorie packs. Uh, the hundred calorie packs don't work for me because I'm like, oh, it's only hundred calories. I can have three. You know what I mean? It, it's I, it doesn't work. $1.99 for the uh, whole wheat crackers. And then I just paid more for them to divide my snack up for me to eat more. Cheese Chris, <laughs> $2.99. Does anybody else do that or do you guys have self control? I mean, I, I don't do that anymore because I don't buy them, but $2.99 for the cauliflower crackers. I don't know. I'm silly. Oh, guys, could you give me a thumbs up? That would be awesome. Uh, $2.29 for the pita crackers. And subscribe if you haven't already. I would appreciate it. Uh, three fifty nine. These are good. I think they're good. What else we got? What's next? Let's see. Oh, the little peanut butter crackers. These are three ninety nine. I wanted to do like the bakery stuff right there, but they were stocking in. I didn't want to bother them. Oh, we got a double picture. Well, heck. Why'd I do that? I don't know. Double the trouble. They had the big chairs. They had the big chairs. So they had three in my store. This box is over 200 pounds. I swear to God. I asked. Um, $19.99 for the stacking planters. It's a nice chair. It's just, I can't, I can't afford almost $500. Uh, look at this. When I walked in, look how nice. We're never going to be able to do the prices. But these were all the snacks. Oh, these were so pretty. And I almost got them because it is rare to find all these plants perfect. And these were perfect. They were $12.99 for the hydrangeas. But my knees are so bad, I'm not going to be able to plant them in the ground. I can't bend. These were pretty, too. Yep. They had a couple different ones you could choose from. I think did I show you the price oh here it is there you go yes a little less than 30 they're nice they're very nice in person this cake is so good I had it two years ago I think oh my god it's so good so good 
And I'm not an Oreo girl. Like, I don't eat Oreos. But I, their cake's good. Look at these. These were marked down. $12.79 for the wreaths and this one. There was two different... There's more than two styles of this wreath. But these were the two that my store had left. I contemplated it. But I have too many wreaths. Um, $6.99 for the bags. The cooler toast. Now we're a little bit in the aisle of shame here. Yes. Everybody's favorite part of this... Okay. My favorite part of the store. $9.99. Thought about getting one of these bags. But the lines were so long because it was the end of the night. And they were almost closed. That I was not waiting in line. I wasn't doing it. Uh, $4.99 for the diffusers. These are nice. Very sleek. Like my daughter would like those. They're very simple. Um, live... Look at, oh, the signs. Wait, 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 wait. These pictures are backwards. Oh, heck. You're going to see those signs, and they're on clearance. So here's more clearance. The triple slow cookers are on clearance. Look, here we go. Huntington Home Spring Reversible Wall Sign, $4.99. Again, I was going to buy these. The line, number one. Number two, I, get to, I don't like a lot of, it's too many signs. But look how pretty this one is so pretty uh oh and then i put out the video for next week of all the like like patriotic snacks worth of july stuff they already had them out oh and then i wanted to show you guys this um potting bench but we can't see the price it was reduced there we go there we go <laughs> coming in clutch with the price 52.99 mark down a little bit they're going to mark down so much stuff this summer, guys, because they got so much inventory. All stores are going to be doing that. Here's the croutons. $1.54, right? I can't see. It's too small. My phone. Oh, they had lots of dressings to choose from. Make sure you're going to Target, Walmart, all those stores. I'm reading all these online articles about the stores having too much inventory. Boom, chicka, wow, wow. Popcorn. That's how I say it. You can't convince me it's said any other way. Two sixty four for the mustard. Yep, a lot of things are going to be clearancing. Lots and lots. See, here's some more of the patriotic snacks. Three twelve. I haven't had a Twinkie in like fifteen years. Sixteen. I can't say specifically, but it's been a really long time. Okay, they had a lot of different popcorns in the store tonight, and there were some in the front I didn't even take pictures of. They had popcorn everywhere. Pop, pop, popping. Two nineteen for the teas. I always think these boxes are so pretty. I gotta get... I like tea. I'm like coffee drinker. I like tea. Here's some coffee, though. For the coffee drinkers in the crowd. Is anybody a coffee drinker? Oh, of course. Well, the majority of people are coffee drinkers. I'm the oddball. Look, and these are not supposed to be out till next week. That's why everybody's like, why don't you do food more? Because a lot of the food in my store comes out super early. Three twenty nine. As soon as it hits the back room at my Aldi, they put it out. Like, they they don't play. So, like, you're probably not going to see it till next week. You know? I just have a staff at my store that's, like, 564 for these mixers. Uh, they're on top of stuff, man. This store is very well run. 419. I hope the manager never leaves because he's amazing. He's amazing. They had these no-show socks for 499. The Isle of Shame, though, like the new products, they have a lot, hundreds of products in the Isle of Shame right now, but nothing that, like, I had to have, you know? 548. I have a feeling. You see my little reflection in there. <laughs> Did you catch it? Uh, 349. I don't care. Everybody knows I'm a fatty, and it is what it is. 349 at this point. You know what I mean? I've been on YouTube six years. These baskets here are pretty cool. Fair farmhouse, I think. Uh, let's see. Oh, these. These would be nice. Uh, maybe a Father's Day gift. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think it would be a nice Father's Day gift. Somebody does a lot of work out in the garage or wherever. Fifteen ninety four for the Tide. I thought prices on these products were high, but you guys told me this is how much this stuff costs everywhere. So thank you for letting me know because I don't buy the name brand. Nine ninety nine for the travel. But I got to tell you, these pillows have like a very hard wire in the middle of them. Um, these are for like two weeks ago, $9.99, but they still had some, so I thought I'd show you. Um, these are all little cute things for your laundry room. And then the personal fans were $9.99. Uh, what else? What else did we take pictures of? 
Oh, the double hanging planters. These were nice in person. $14.99. You hear my dog in the background? He just got up, so he shook. These uh, washable, the big rugs went quick. These are the runners for $19.99. They're like the, the knockoff of the, the name brand ones. $14.99 for the baskets. I had to stop. I got the hiccups. I'm back. $14.99. Oh, heck, we got a sideways picture. I don't know how to fix that. Oh, those are just more of the double hanging planters. I, I was trying to be nice. Let me see. Oh, it's too late. I was going to see if I could go back and fix it. Uh, $6.99. You can roll your little plants around. So that's cool. Uno game, $4.99. I play Uno all the time on the computer and the Facebook. I, I've, I have for years. It's fun. Oh, they marked these down too, or no? Ecokins. Is that what it says? Oh, they had the bathing suits, the little kid bathing suits, $14.99. I was afraid to pull one out. I, th I thought they were all going to come out at the same time. I was like, oh, heck no. $9.99 for the shoes. They have very good prices on the shoes at Aldi. Then we got some for Breeze for $2.94. Rubberies. The downies. 1094. I can't I can't afford the little beads right now. That's too much that's too much money. $4.99. <laughs> I use Dollar Tree laundry detergent and Epsom salts because I have hard water. And I I love it. Uh, mixing bowl set. These are gonna be $16.99. I don't even use fabric softener because the Epsom salt softens everything up. Here's the spin sweeper. Do those, where does this stuff go? Is it going like in? Don't make fun of me. Does it go inside the sweeper and then you empty it? Thirty-four ninety-nine for the window fan. I did not see that in the preview uh, videos. I did. <laughs> I didn't feel. I didn't see it in the ad. Is what I meant to say. Twelve ninety-nine for the curtains. Pretty, pretty normal pricing. $39.99 for the quilts. Chewy wants me to pay attention to him right now, but he has to understand I'm busy. Uh, $7.99. These are so cute. I played with him for like an hour before I did this video on purpose so he would go to sleep, but he apparently is not tired. $7.99 for the stretch belts. These are nice belts. Pretty, you know, pretty nice for eight bucks. Come on. And these are $12.99. You can see the sizes right here on your screen. I wish they would make plus size. I wish I was skinny. Let's let's refer. I wish I was back to being skinny. Okay. $17.99. I'm working on it. $17.99 for the sheets. But until then, I'd like them to carry plus size. Extra, extra large goes up to in the men's two pack sleep shorts. Oh, I might be able to fit in the extra, extra large. I should check those out. $5.99. These are cute. I don't need them, but they're cute. $7.99. It's a nice set with the like the little wood base. Don't you guys think that I like that? Oh, some more curtains. <laughs> what did I do, guys? I'm telling you, I took these pictures so quick. I'm glad you accept me for being imperfect. $16.99 for the mixing bowl set. Mm-hmm. The tablecloths are twelve ninety nine. They're cotton too, which is nice. I wonder if they're a blend though. Oh, these little toys here. Eight ninety nine for the cat. The little laser toy. That seems like fun. These were nice. I thought about it, but again the line. Twelve ninety nine because everything in my house is wood and metal. Salt and pepper mills. I think those are nice. Those look fancy, like a restaurant. Eight ninety nine for the avocado. No, guacamole or avocado. Yeah, there's a avocado maker too, or holder. Or you know what I'm saying. Three ninety nine for the laundry bags. That was part of that little laundry thing they had going on there. And then sixteen ninety nine. These are wine cooler totes. On this side, it has like a spigot, like a spigot, or you can pour the wine out. Okay, apparently I put my thumbnail in, in my video. <laughs> You'll see this on the front of this video, guys. <laughs> uh, 
$8.49 for the big box of burgers. And they had some ice cream. I don't drink coffee, but I like coffee ice cream. Isn't that funny? They had some coffee ice cream that looked good. Lots of, I just took a few pictures of it here in this freezer. There was the most was, was ice cream. I was going to take pictures of like meat and stuff just so you guys could see the pricing over there. But, uh, it was pretty empty, like empty, empty, like, like the meat was empty. I was shocked, but it was the end of the day too, though, you know? So here's a few more. These always come out dark over here. The lighting is really bad in this part of the store. These are so good. These fat boy ice creams, they're like 465. I think, oh, so good. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I greatly appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you made it to the end, you're my favorite. Thumbs up and hit the bell so you're notified the next time I upload. I'll talk to you down in the comments. Bye, guys.